Hello and welcome to Karo Lifestylists Learn About Tarot Card Series. Each meditation contains a card description and then gently guides you into meditation using a soothing, calming, breathing technique and guides you to open your third eye chakra. You will then hear the cards reading in which you can meditate on that reading. Enjoy these educational meditations which are best listened to with headphones. Today's card is Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords is ready and charging. He is dressed in full armour and spurring his powerful white horse on as he holds his sword high. He is motivated and dedicated. His intellectual energy is pure and he is ready to face any obstacles that may come across his path. There is a strong wind and a brewing storm in the background, but the knight courageously proceeds straight into the gale, relentless in his mission. During this meditation, I will guide you to relax through a breathing calmness technique and then I'll bring your focus to your third eye chakra. You will listen openly without thought, without judgment as I explain the meaning of your chosen card. You will then comfortably and effortlessly meditate on your tarot card. As we focus our minds, I ask you that you just allow your mind to be open and to have no expectations of any specific outcome of this meditation. Just go with the flow and allow to happen whatever happens for you. Enjoy all of these easy to listen, just listen, guided meditations which are best enjoyed with headphones. So let's get started. Get yourself in a comfortable position, either sitting in a comfortable chair with feet flat on the ground or sitting in yogi lotus position on the floor. You may prefer to lie down and you can rest your hands on your knees or in your lap. Loosen any tight clothing or belts and you can remove your shoes so the soles of your feet become grounded. The important thing here is just to do whatever is comfortable for you. Go ahead and close your eyes. Take a deep breath in through the nose for a count of four, bringing fresh oxygen into your body, into your chest and belly. Hold for a count of four, allowing the air to flow throughout your body. Exhale through the mouth for a count of six, pushing the air slowly all the way out. Sense your belly deflating. Again, inhale through the nose for a count of four. Feel your belly, belly full with fresh oxygen. Hold for a count of four. Exhale through the mouth for a count of six. Again, inhale for a count of four. Be aware of the air entering through your body to your belly. Hold for a count of four. The freshly breathed air flowing through you, reaching every corner of your body from the top of your head to the tips of your toes. Exhale through the mouth for a count of six. Feeling the air touching the back of your throat, passing over your lips and expelling into the atmosphere. Again, inhale for four, three, two, one. Hold, four, three, two, one. Exhale, six, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, six, five, 
four, three, two, one. I'll leave you here for a few moments to focus on your breath as you allow your whole body to release, relax and let go. center which is capable of providing you with powerful insight, intuition, wisdom and the ability to make considered and correct choices regarding all aspects of your life. Imagine a beautiful purple lotus flower with its many petals opening up, awakening, opening up to flowing senses, allowing a pathway to enlightenment with each petal that opens and blooms toward the universe, opens your third eye chakra more and more until its petals of this beautiful purple lotus flower Just listen as I recall your tarot card reading. Your reading for Knight of Swords. You are the epitome of a knight in shining armour. Yes girls can be knights too. You're brave and ready for action. You have a lot of physical energy and mental stamina and you know how to combine these two to make the most of your gifts. There is very little that can dissuade you from accomplishing something you've set your mind to. Your valour is one of your best qualities and your intentions are pure. Just make sure that you don't pick a fight with someone who's just trying to help you by pointing out some flaws in your plan. They might only be saving you trouble in the long run, so charging ahead might not be the best option before you take a look at what they have to say. While the Knight of Swords is a card with very noble characteristics, this person can become overpowering if they do not remain mindful of their actions and the effects they have on others. If this meaning does not resonate with you, someone in your life will sweep them up and help you gain forward momentum and the courage to face the future. Now I will leave you here to meditate on the meaning of this card for you. And when you hear a chime, I will guide you back to full awakeness.
welcome back. Continue to use these Just Listen Koru Lifestylist meditation practices until you are fluent in their practices. And when you find you need to remove negative energy, toxicity, or change the way of being that is not serving you, you will be able to meditate instantly into the exact right meditation for you, quickly, effortlessly, for quick recovery. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Koru Lifestylist Meditations, and click on the little bell icon so you can be notified on any new meditations and hypnotherapies as they are released. Join me again tomorrow for more Just Listen Meditations. Rest, breathe, smile. Namaste.